But this is like this is the best edition of Kazuya. This song. Three, two, Ooh. So one, Mr. E go. did beat Quid in winter semis. Quid did SD a lot, but he did still get the win in a pretty solid manner. He still played the matchup really well. You know, but if he, if he beat Quid, Quid is fantastic. The question is, what can Noku do differently? Because, you know, that's that's already one PT down. Here's the next one. But that's the thing. Quid and Noku are two very different PTs. If you exactly. watch them both play a lot, you will see. Westchester doesn't just have two at the same PT over and over. They are two completely different players. You know, and we see we see it right now. As he's already at 100%, and Noku has the advantage. Switching to Ivy Sword because we right already know we don't want to score at this point. Right off to Zard. Not even gonna bother with Ivy. That's his. Uh, that's his best. That's his best uh, Pokemon. Zard, yes, absolutely. His Zard is insane. Coming in with the Flare Blitz, I like the option. And now you're on the ledge against Mr. E. And oh my God, I like the patience from him. So he's not over, not not committing to something too hard and just waiting for Noku to mess up. Oh, right there. You Great cannot overcommit against Zard with Lucina. That's how you lose. That's how you die. That's how you get up smashed. <laughs> yes, that's exactly how you get up smashed. And Eric knows that. Any good Lucina knows that. Lucina is not a character where you push forward. Lucina is a character where you wait and you get your punishes when you can. Oh, Very no. Very good going on edge guard. Deep. And Mr. E, unfazed entirely, just ready for it. Shooting to stick with the squirtle. Great up smash. That was a really good up smash. All right, and we are tied 2-2 right now. Noku going for the bread and butter. Uh, well, actually, that is not. I thought he was going to go for it, but I don't know where the up smash came from. I have no clue. That just did not look like that was supposed to happen. And now And Noku he's... has no jump, and he knows. Good switch to charge. The block pressure from Noku. <laughs> The, pro the problem is right now is that he he's on the ledge once again, and this is just this is just a perilous position to be, especially against a player who's so, like you know, like this who's so good, whose ledge trapping is just insane. Look at that, Noku can't find a way to get up, and even though Charizard may be his best character, it's definitely putting him in a bad position, trying to get, just trying to get back on stage. Yeah. Switch to a different Pokemon, get back on stage, and switch back. But he can't switch because if he switches to any of the other ones, he's gonna die. these aerials are just going to kill him. So then it doesn't even matter if he gets back, because he's just going to die. You know, like, he would have died to that up oh with any other Pokemon. God. He lived to 185. That's a high number. If he can lift to 185 with Zard again, he can win this game. The question is, can he take the stop before that? That was a very Good. unfortunate up tilt from Noki doing it in the wrong direction. Nice DP. Eric was ready for that re-grab, but it wasn't quite close enough. Oh my god, I like it. Waiting for Eric to actually actually use the pair, and then coming in with the upper. Oh Noku. my god! It didn't work. Noku. <laughs> Balls of steel over here. What you mean? That's the Noku classic. <laughs> the in charge smash, F smash? Yeah, in Smash 4 it was down throw down here with Diddy. In this game it's charge F smash that ledge with Ivy. <laughs> Right, he doesn't even do it that much, and that's still the Nogu. Bringing out the Zard once again. All he needs is one hit. Just one hit to just take the stock. That could have been it. Oh that should have been it. Oh my god. That fair was not spaced at all. That could have been up smash, and that's going to be a left jump back. Yeah, I guess they are playing smash for it. Ledge jump backers are so much harder to do this one. <laughs> this is not a thing. You have to condition for that. It's, if someone sees it coming, this is not going to work. Uh, but great job by Mr. E to take out the first, uh, Very take good the first job. game. And. You know, like you said, he beat Quid to get here, and he and he's showing that he he he's capable of of you know just really handling any PT that comes his way. Yeah. But my what I what I want to see Noku do is you know playing playing Charizard so much on the ledge is really getting him like it's getting him beat up. <laughs> yeah. Um, and it it. it I understand why, because obviously, you know, when, when in doubt, go with, go with your main. But he needs to take control of neutral more before making such a switch like that. It's putting him in that bad, in that bad position. Okay. Robert, doing a pretty good job so far. He has Eric in the corner already. It's been 15 seconds now. So, you know, pretty good start for Noku, but he had a really good start last game, so... Last, last game start was arguably even better than this one. 
This game still was better than this one. He went from like 11 to 100. I like this. Using Squirtle's mobility to just keep you in check. Oh, he's going for another no Okay, all right, all right. That, that's not gonna work. <laughs> it might. It might, but you have to, you have to condition. Easy e now knows that it's gonna happen. No, no, no. The thing is though, the thing about the F smash is there are two spacings for it. One of them covers every option but roll. The other covers the roll but doesn't cover like drop back options or drop down options. Good option. E letting go of shield a bit too early. Noku is dead. We're killing himself right now. Eric has no jump. Okay, oh, good. just missed time to just a bit. And he's dead. Yeah. Over 125 on Mr. E. If he can get this kill soon, that leap's not going to matter that much. It? No, it's not. It'll be, but it is Squirtle. I think it back to the right now. <laughs> I mean, any Squirtle smash attack, back throw, that's gonna kill. Oh my god, but he is going he can to die. Very He's soon. not letting him. Oh, the down air was coming. Trying to call out a jump with that. Oh, but he got stuck. Not gonna get it quite yet. He's still sticking through with the Squirtle, though, a little bit. And that was a really good back air. Unfortunately, that mystery just fell out of it. Tragic scenario, but that is the game we play. Multi hits don't work. I, nice good bait. bait on the air dodge. Yeah, no, a good bait. He, he baited him with the up and just like he fell into the air. That was, that was good. And that's kind of what I want to see from him. It's like forcing E to commit to an option that puts him in a bad situation. But right now, E's ledge trapping is just too insane right now. He's not letting him get back up. This is insane. Yeah. Just the problem right now is. Lucina is a character that doesn't really have to commit to anything. The only thing Lucina has to commit to doing is dashing towards you and staying out of your range. But none of those are really that committal in this game. And he's doing a very good job at just playing those zones, knowing where he can get hit. Oh my god! Let it rip. Mr. E is dominating him. What an up smash! Oh, that was a really good up smash. I don't know if he just caught Noku because I don't know if he was vulnerable or like Noku tried to like quickly tether cancel, but he uh, didn't come out. But uh, he waited just too long. God damn! All right, and we are taking it back to battlefield. Pokemon trainer. Noku sticking with Pokemon trainer. Does he play? I know he used to play Diddy, right? Not in this game. Not in this game. Not in this game. Huh. So in this game, he played Corrin until he Three, found out about PT, two, and one, now he only go. plays PT in random. Ah, uh, okay. okay. So we, are, we are sick with the same characters. Let's see if we can bring this back. All right. Ooh, okay, okay. All right, 51%. All right, but you see the difference. He, need, he needs to keep you at the ledge. He needs to rack up all this stuff. Oh, my God. Uh, he's fine. Again, fair blitz. <laughs> Armoring through the fair, man. Back here? Oh, I thought it was gonna be jump back here. Alright, no, right, Eric's off stage. Oh, that could have been a stock. Had no food, just been a little bit quicker. And now we are back to square one with Noku being on the wrong side of the stage. I like that. It was it was a very it was an it was an interesting option because yes, he takes damage from flare blitz, but he did get out of the stage. Oh my god! Did it again. I guess this is a flare blitz game. I mean, I mean, I, when you start throwing that, when you start throwing that move out, it's it's it, it's fear. <laughs> it fear is. is a very real thing. Oh, absolutely. Yep. Can and is gonna kill? kill? Not nope. yet. Fourth, I would have. Okay, I like I like that from Just kind of swimming around, fishing for that back air, hoping that he makes his. You can't try to pressure a Lucina Ariel. They can just up beat you afterwards, and you gotta hold that. You gotta be ready. It's a 50 50. If you drop shield, they're gonna hit you. But really, the problem with these games so far for Noku has just been he couldn't close out the first stock. He did a very good job of surviving for as long as he needed to, he just couldn't close it out. And then he starts getting snowballed slowly and slowly. Oh, he's still not gonna do it, Mr. E living at 160%. There you go. Dante's gonna take it though. Just 
just like that, we have Team Squirtle down to a kill. <laughs> 66%—not the worst situation. This is definitely—you can bring this back with a couple good hits. Oh no, yeah, for sure. Especially I just saw. Oh my God, Mister E Such is a good catch, and now he's waiting for the edge guard. Another left shot back air. Oh, we were wow. Tech chase with the down smash, but he didn't even need it. He knew Noku was going to neutral tag. Mr. E just taking all of this damage on the ledge. Noku just trying to get back. All right, I like the goddamn. Did wow, that, the that hurt. Yeah. <laughs> all right, see, now the issue for Eric is he's at ledge against Zard. Mm -hmm. And this is what no Noku needs to keep him there. Oh, my God. And suddenly, Noku has a lead. Who would have thought? It's almost like heavy just Yes. Know how you're surprised that he died and I'm not. Very true, very true. It's Zard. This character is stupid. This character kills so early. And he's, I mean, he's also at max rate too. Well, yeah. Not anymore, but yes. Yeah. Well, max rate Zard. Back though, back here is killing people at 10. That back air is absurd. And it's just what Noku needed to try to crawl back to the set. Try to find his footing. Only down 10% right now. That's nothing. That's jump change. And it's gone. But in the air against Hussina, you want to make sure that you're able to land properly. Very good landing back here from Mr. E. Fighting his way out of disadvantage. Oh, the weight was great. Oh, that down tilt save. He knew that Noku wanted the F smash, and unfortunately, he gave it to him. Yeah. 